And scientists have discovered a brand new exoplanet. They say planet TWA-7b was found orbiting a star 110 light years away from Earth. And within a disk of rocky debris and dust surroundings, its host star offering fresh insights into planetary formations. The new planet is young, only about 6 million years old and about the same mass as Saturn in our own solar system. Scientists say that the exoplanet is almost 10 times lighter than the planets that have been imaged that have been seen so far. The system is seen uh, Poland, meaning that uh, we see it from above. So it's uh, much easier to detect a planet uh, in a disk like that. And so this is why we, we looked at this uh, specific system uh, with uh, James Webb. And, um, and we found this, uh, this uh, very light planet. It is uh, 10 times lighter than the planets that have been imaged so far. Uh, so it makes it it's at about the same mass as Saturn in our solar system. So it's very, very light compared to what we were able to image before. The discovery was made possible by the James Webb Space Telescope, the largest and most powerful astronomical observatory ever launched. Positioned over a million miles from Earth, Webb's unprecedented sensitivity allows scientists to detect smaller, lighter planets than ever before. I think we have just opened a, a new uh, window in uh, uh, thanks to the incredible capacity of, uh, of, James, of uh, James Webb, it's very good, good, good uh, uh, sensitivity. So uh, I think uh, there will be uh, several, I hope, and I think that there will be other planets like that in the, in the future that will be imaged by uh, James Webb. Yeah. The star was first spotted by the Hubble Space Telescope in 1999, but the Webb Telescope detected something particularly bright inside an otherwise empty section of the star's second ring. Scientists are now hoping to find Earth-like planets one day. They are also expecting that the Webb Telescope will be able to spot planets even smaller than this one. We will find other planets further, but we would like also, we will, like, we will try to look at other planets like this one closer to the to the star to the to the star yeah uh, and uh, with the data that we have already we know that we could still uh, be able to detect even uh, lighter planets uh, we can go to uh, one person one uh, one uh, one tenth of a jupiter mass uh, uh, which is about uh, 30 earth masses uh, James Webb has released the sensitivity to, to image this type of planets.